What's going on YouTube? Jeans here, bringing you guys more content for Pokemon Sword and Shield. In today's video, we're having back on to rank double ladder with this Blastoids and Colossal team. So if you guys are hyped, make sure you support the channel by smashing that like button and clicking that big red subscribe button. Seriously, it only takes a second of your guys' time to help support and grow the channel. So on this team right here, we have Pelper Choice Scarf. This kind of throws me off a little bit because it has Tailwind and we can just Choice Scarf into a Tailwind, but I don't really like that too, too much. I probably would switch them to a different item if this was a team that I built, but I didn't. But he has Tailwind, Scald, Ice Beam, and Hurricane, and Drizzle as his ability to set the rain. We have Colossal with Steam Engine, and what Steam Engine allows us to do is when we get hit by a water move, it booster speed all the way up to max. So we have that and weakness policy. So if we get hit by a water move, it's full speed ahead and big attack power. So he'll be able to do some big damage once you trigger both of them. Then we have the Passimian right here with close combat. Knockoff for items. I love knockoff. I think knockoff is such a strong move in this game, considering you just take off their items. And once you take off their items, most Pokemon are done after that. But some Pokemon just like rely on their items a lot. Then he has Iron Head and Faint. He has the Soul Fest so we can actually eat up some physical attack, or not physical attack, special attack moves. And then Defiant as its ability to boost his physical attack when, say, like an Intimidate rolls through. Then we got my boy Blastoise, who is like the main boy of this thing. Him and Colossal. He has Protect Aqua Jet to actually go into the Colossal to trigger that Steam Engine slash weakness policy. He has Flash Cannon for Sap and Big Damage Water Spout with Rain Dish as its ability. So in... Rain, it's kind of like he's getting leftover health constantly, and Mystic Water as its item. We have the Hatterwing down here, who is just our Trick Room Pokemon, in case we want to set it with that Cobra Barry with Dazzling Green, Protect, Trick Room, and Giga Drain for coverage. And then in the final spot, we have the boy Raichu. I've been using him a lot, and I've been absolutely loving him, especially with that Lightning Rod. He has the Lightning Rod ability, and Focus Sash, so he doesn't die in one turn. He has Fake Out, Rain Dance, so that's another way for us to set the Rain, Thunderbolt, and Nuzzle for Paralyzed Control. Guys, if you want to use this team for yourself, Run the code is at the bottom of the screen. And let me know for question of the day. Are you guys going to be picking up the new Animal Crossing game as it comes out on Friday, March 20th, which I think it will be tomorrow by the time I upload this. But yeah, I'm so hyped for that game. So I'm going to be picking that up, doing playthroughs on the channel, streams and all that. So definitely check out my stream. Link in the description below. But definitely let me know if you guys are going to be picking it up yourselves. But guys, without further ado, let's hop onto this ranked double ladder and try to get some teams with this colossal Blastoise squad. I forgot to mention that this Colossal is a G-Max Colossal, so we'll be able to show him off here. He kind of works just like a G-Max Anaconda with his uh, G-Max move. But this guy has a rain team up in battle number one. We got Joe Mama reversing this dude's name's Joe. Uh, I think he's going to go maybe set the rain, or he might go Lapras. Cloyster's kind of scary as well. But I'm going to definitely go Blastoids into Colossal. He can set the rain if he wants. I'm going to go Passimian as well. And then do I go into... My Raichu of my own? Yeah, let's go Raichu in the back end. We'll, we'll, we'll bring that Raichu, get him rolling in here. But Simeon is also a great pick, but I was just like, dude, I need this Raichu instead. I need this Raichu considering he has basically a rank. He basically has a rank team. But guys, you want to catch more content from me? You guys already know the deal. Come hang out with me. Jeans25 on Twitch. Link is in the description below. Seriously, we're starting to grow a community over there. And I'd love to see more of you guys come hang out with me. But let's get it. He's going to lead the Lapris and Milote. Uh, do we let him trigger the Steam Engine or... Yeah, do we let him trigger the Steam Engine and we just drop a rock? We could let him trigger the Steam Engine. No, no, no. We're just going to Aqua Jet straight into him. And then we should be able to outspeed after that. I'm going to drop this thing. I'm going to drop this thing on this lap. It's time to get out of here. Maybe I shouldn't have uh, triggered his weakness policy. Maybe I should have just started boosting our special defense. But I would love to get this rolling and show off a little bit of G-Max Colossal here. He's got to be Dynamax in the... The Lapras. Right? You gotta be down to max that. But seriously, once we trigger this uh, weakness policy, we'll be plus six on speed, which it's still, it's decently fast, but it's just like some Pokemon will still outspeed it because he's a rather slow Pokemon. But we'll get this out here, and then we'll have that weakness policy boost as well, so it'll be plus two attack, plus two special attack. And honestly, I think the Milotic is going to go for a Hypnosis. Um, I'm almost positive. Now, now after I click that move, I'm like, yo, he's gonna put me to sleep. But look at this dude. This dude is a beast. He's a big mountain looking thing. He's gonna go with the protect. Okay, my lord of protects. We take those. And he doesn't Dynamax his Lapras, so we might be able to just tank that thing out. Aqua Jet comes through. Let's go. Deal a little bit of damage. A decent amount, actually. The Colossal. It gets a crit, of course. I was wondering why it did so much. Steam Engine pops. Of course, we crit ourselves. Get out of my face. Steam Engine and Weakness Policy pop here. We could potentially just take out this Lapras and then have this, uh, this little, uh, G-Max, like, little pester damage going around. But look at this. Let's get it. Yo, yeah, you take him out. Just dump on it. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Lapras out of here. That's how you counter. Oh, and it drops a little, like, rocks. Like, volcano rocks come out here. Now they're all surrounded by rocks. It's going to do a little bit of pester damage all around. 
We still have Flash Cannon as well. Look at that. Look at that. A little pester damage. It's kind of like a G Max Wildfire. Kind of just does that. This thing has leftovers. So, Simeon would have been huge here. But Simeon honestly would have been huge here. But I got to go after the Milotic here. I'll probably drop a Quake into it to boost our special defense. I'm so mad we did a crit to ourselves. And Ludicolo gets the pop. Ludicolo gets the popskis. Um, bump, bump, bump. I could protect. I could protect predicting a grass move. Or I could swap. What is the call? Oh, I do have Pissimian. Who did I thought I'd bring? I do have Pissimian. Okay, that's going to be nice. Who did I think we brought? We didn't bring the Pelper, Hatterene. And then who's the last one? No, it's just Pelper, Hatterene. Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah, we did bring... <laughs> oh, my God. Why didn't I think we brought uh, Pissimian? <laughs> um, I might just protect. Or should I go for a Flash Cannon? Mm. I mean, all these moves stink. I mean, I'm just going to go for, to be honest, just a water spout. And then boost our, uh, and then boost our, uh, special defense here. Maybe I should have went for a flare. Set the drought. That might have been a nice call to make, to set the drought. Because hopefully it just goes for an overgrowth on my blast tweets, because I kind of don't really need my blast tweets to do too much anymore. Ah. I'm hoping that. I'm hoping he just goes after the blast tweets. Just a nice stretch. That felt good. <laughs> But I'm hoping, I'm hoping. But we just dumped on that Lapras, which is huge, because they are such a pain. But Max Quake's going to come out here, because we're full speed and all that. Let's go. Can we take it out? Can we do it? Oh, no. We need this Water Spout. We need this Water Spout. Blastoids, go first. Blastoids, honestly, should be able to outspeed that Ludicolo without Swift Swim. We'll see. We get the Special Defense boost as well. Muddy Water pops out here. Colossal avoids it. That's beautiful. That's fine. Blastoids going to take a tad bit. A tad bit. Can Blastoids go? Honestly, this Blastoids kind of slow if Milo takes out speeding it. Yeah, see, guys are just going to fly through here. Ooh! That's tough news. Only if we had Storm Drink Gashon. That's probably going to KO, to be honest. Yeah. Okay, so we're out of here. Uh, Water Spout should be able to take out the... What's it called? And we got the rain going as well. Ooh, that's nice for us. Yeah, Water Spout should be able to take out the... The what's it called? The Milotic. And then I could go into my Pessimian and roll out with some... Uh, with some what's it called? Actually, Milotic avoids the attack. Yo, get out of my face. Seriously, get off of me. This game is terrible. This game is doo-doo. Like, bruh, what you mean? Doo-doo game. <laughs> oh, actually, will this take out? Yes, let's go! The Volcalyph, however you pronounce it. Yo, let's go. I totally forgot about that. Good thing we did send it. I could go to Pissimian and save Raichu for later. Raichu does have the fake out. And then we could nuzzle up. Yeah, let's start doing that, and then I can knock off and kind of play around later with that. But we're going to go Raichu. Did he go Raichu? Oh, we seen double Raichu. we seen double Raichu here. Um. <laughs> well, it's in the air with air balloon. I think I just totally need to go into a protect here. And then drop a fake out on him. Just in case he goes for a fake out on me. I got I to gotta try to match him at least. You know. Because he has to be going for a fake out. And if he doesn't, we get the fake out on him. But so he's going to protect... What you want, fool. So he has two more turns after this Dynamax. I see an Overgrowth popping now. Fake out pops here. Yeah, we get our fake out. Boop. A little bit of damage. And I can nuzzle up on that Ludicolo in a little bit. In just a little bit. Overgrowth's going to come through. Yeah, I kind of saw that coming. So can we eat this up to survive another turn here? Yeah, yo. Protect coming in clutch. Protect coming in clutch. Okay, so now what is the call? I think call would be a nice big water spout. Or maybe an Aqua Jet into the Raichu. We have this rain dish. Because I don't want that thing outspeeding me. Actually, once we get this nuzzle up, you will not outspeed me. So water spout might be the call. The Raichu will though. The Raichu will outspeed though. So we we have lightning rod. We have lightning rod. What am I worried about? I think nuzzle goes through it though. I'm pretty sure nuzzle goes through. Hmm. I'm pretty sure nuzzle goes through lightning rods. I'm almost positive. Let's go, let's do this. Let's go here. I'm gonna go for a nu nice little nuzzle on me. What you want, fool? What you want? You want to play games with me? And we still have a Pissimian in the back, which is huge. Let's just see what happens. Because Water Spout in the rain with this Mystical, that thing outsped my Raichu? We are sashed. We are sashed, so I'm cool with it. I'm cool with it. We are sashed. Yes, sir. Sash coming in clutch. We're going to go with the Nuzzle. Lightning Rod does trigger? I'm all confused. I'm not confused. Like, I just feel like I this happened before. This thing, of course, is grass. Not. It's going to KO. Actually, no, it does not. Okay, we still get this water spout, but it's not going to do as much. 
For some reason, why did I think that, uh... Like, I totally thought Water Spout maybe, uh... Not Water Spout, Nuzzle went through Lightning Rods. Because I remember playing somebody, and it was doing it unless the viewer... Because I was doing a viewer battle. Unless the viewer told me he had Lightning Rod and actually didn't have Lightning Rod. Because that totally threw me off. That totally threw me off. But, yo, the moment for Jeans. Local is going to come through. Aqua Jet will pick up the KO on the Raichu. And that Ludicolo is done. That Ludicolo is done. He's out of here. So, actually, I'm going to Nuzzle it up right now. Uh, Raichu doesn't... I doubt it has protect. I don't want to Nuzzle it up right now. Actually, I'm just going to chop... Hmm. What should I do here? I definitely want to roll into an Aqua Jet. I doubt this thing is rocking out with protect. I doubt it's going into a protect. So, I'm just going to Nuzzle it. Because Aqua Jet will go first. Take out the Raichu. Then we'll be storming on from there. Let's go. Aqua Jet comes through. What you mean? What you mean? Get out of my face! This game is doo-doo! This game is trash! It is the second time we miss this battle. Oh my god, don't you dare tell me we lose because of this. This game is so trash, dude. <laughs> I am so salty right now. We're going to lose this game because of that? Whack. That is whack, yo. Are you kidding me? We had this one, like, wrapped up in the bag. Aqua Jet connects by Raichu. Nuzzle, we have the Pissimian in the back for support. But, bro, we missed our Aqua Jet? Off me, yo. Get off me. We have Fent or Faint. This attack targets moves such as Protect. It also lifts the effects of those moves. That's pretty dope. Um, I think Knockoff's probably our best option. We go into this and take out the Raichu. I am so frustrated. Giga Dream pops here. He's going to get some HP back. We have the Assault Vest. Man. Oh. That is whack. D-Ball comes through. That's probably going to KO because we gave him the special attack boost. We survived. So you're saying there's a chance. He needs to miss. We need to KO here. Okay, so we KO. We need this dude to miss. And then we need to do some mean work on him. The rain stopped. Bruh, are you kidding me? You can't make these things up, guys. You guys know that for a fact. You cannot make these things up. <laughs> the Looty Cole is a fast little Looty Cole. He's outspeeding me. And I gotta go into a close combat. This is my last option. Stab close combat. Hopefully he misses. Miss, 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 miss. Like, come on, yo. We missed twice. You gotta miss. Oh, no. We got speed. Did we pick a KO? Come on. Oh. 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 So close. Oh. Miss? No, he hits. Of course he connects. He was outspeeding us because of the rain. I totally forgot about it. But, bruh. We just lost that match because we missed the tags. Whack. This is why this game gets me salty sometimes. You guys know it. But GG to that guy. We go 0 1 in that first match. Battle number two on its way. I'm still salty about that last match. Like, come on. We really missing those attacks. But this guy's a trick room team. I can possibly see him leading that Snorlax trying to roll out from there. So I'm actually going to go Passimian into. Do I really want to go Raichu? Because if he just plays Psychic Surge, we cannot fake out. I definitely want to go Passimian. Um, do I want to go Hatterene? Or do I want to go Blastoids? I could go Blastoids here. Um, or do I want to go Blastoids Colossal? I kind of want that Pissimian just in case he wants to roll out and try to go for that um, that Belly Jump Snorlax. Because that could be scary. We can do some work on the Clops as well from there. Um, bum, bum, bum. Let's just go Raichu. Let's just go Raichu. I can Nuzzle start controlling out. And then I want to go Colossal Blastoids, I think, in the back end. I think that is the play call. I don't really like that Pelipper. I don't know why. I just think it's because it's Scarf. I mean, maybe you can come in, like, clutch in a back-end situation. But, I don't I just don't like the Scarf option for him. Like, I just don't think that's a Pelipper item. But, we're chilling here. We're 0-1 right now. Mm. Why we miss that attack? That Aqua Jet was key. Like, how do you miss an Aqua Jet? I'm, like, the only person who would ever miss an Aqua Jet. <laughs> but it goes Milotic into the Whimsy Poo. Which I'm cool with. I'm totally cool with. Um, so we're gonna go right here. I'm gonna knock off whatever item that, uh, that what's called is holding. That Milotic is holding. Actually, he might go for a, uh... To be honest, he might go for that. For a, uh, a Protect. But I think he's gonna go into Protect. Possibly, maybe, and just set up the Tailwind. But I don't want to du double up into it. Hmm. I'm definitely just gonna... I'm gonna fly out with an Iron Head here. And I'm gonna drop a Nuzzle over on you. I'm gonna drop a Nuzzle on this Milotic. I'm not trying to deal with it. I'm thinking it might go for a Protect. Why don't I fake out? I'm dumb. Why didn't I fake out the Wimscott? He probably he's probably thinking it now, so it actually might work out in our favor. But yeah, we totally should have faked out. Okay, Milotic protects. I knew it. I knew it. Are we seeing a double protect? He's gonna charm me. 
Oh, you're charming. Whoa, 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 wait, what? Why are you charming that? That actually works great for us. Why are you charming that? That charm minus his attack. Um, okay. Charm minus his attack. Um, that, that, I'm, I'm cool with it. <laughs> I'm cool with it. Um, how should I play this one out? I'm gonna Iron Head. Hmm. Yeah, definitely gonna Iron Head here. I'm gonna nuzzle up. No, 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 please. Why? Why did I buy accident? Click that. Why did I click the Whimsicott? I needed the Milo tank. My hand slipped and then my leg hit the back button because these back buttons count as hits. Like, come on, dude. It's just not my day today. It is just not my day. But, bro, yo, we should have paralyzed this thing. That was going to probably take me out. But I have a sash. But still, okay. Charm's going to pop here. But the charm minus is... Oh, it's competitive. Okay. Now I see. Now I'm seeing. Nuzzle Buzzle pops out. Can Nuzzle Buzzle KO? It does not. <laughs> Iron Head's going to pick up the KO here. And now this thing's, like, stacked up. This thing is stacked up. It's scary. Hopefully it sets the rain, maybe, for me. Gee, I don't know. Like... So I'm sitting in a very tough situation. Guys, you're going to fly through all my... Raichu? Oh, my Pissimian. Okay. Pissimian eats, though, with that soul pass. I'm going to knock off its item. I don't care what it is. I'm going to tell it to get out of here. And I'm going to nuzzle it. And I'm going to nuzzle it. Actually, it depends who comes in. What is this item? It's got to be policy, right? If it is policy, I kind of just want to nuzzle up over on the Tokus and knock off its item that side. But I can totally see more follow moves. I'm gonna go into here. I'm gonna nuzzle buzzle you up. I'm gonna nuzzle buzzle this Tokus up. But dude, we could have had a paralyze on the Milotic. So mad. I'm human. <laughs> I'm really not that mad. I'm just saying it. <laughs> you guys know me. I, I don't get. I don't get too mad. I kind of just go with the flow. Let's see what happens here. Follow me. No, no, follow me. Okay, this is why I didn't want to trigger that thing's weakness policy. So we're gonna paralyze that and then just take off its item, just in case, because I'm thinking it might be weakness policy. See what happens. That thing is uh that is weakness policy. Um, okay. Never mind. I'm dumb. Not off comes through. You what are we taking off of him? What are we taking off? It's life orb. Okay, that's beautiful. Why didn't I realize it was life orb? But Pasimian actually might no, but I just gonna sash up. Beautiful, so we sash here. And this is probably double kill with a dazzling. Unless he paralyzed. No! Probably double kill. I triggered his weakness policy. It's getting a little tough. Okay, so we're here. We're sitting here. We got a slower Togekiss. We're in the rain. Colossal's... Eh, I have to Dynamax Colossal. That's a fact. Right? I got to Dynamax to Colossal Bossal. And maybe just go into, like, a water spout to try to take out that Togekiss. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Like, Colossal definitely has to get that Dynamax. Actually... Let's protect first. Let's protect and go into our... Own water spout, or I could go into a flash cannon. What do we think we do more? We affect the flash cannon, stab all this damage. We're going into this. We're going into this in the rain as well. But I'm hoping protect comes through. Max geyser flies, hits us. We eat it up. We trigger all our good stuff. Who kisses paralyzed as well? That's lovely. He was going to go for a follow me. Guys are coming through. Let's go. This might have been my call because I didn't want to guard. I want to trigger all this stuff. Still doing a heaping amount. That is ridiculous. That is ridiculous. The protect comes through. We got steam engine trigger now. And we have this as well. And we have our weakness policy. Okay. So, not over yet. Not over yet. If we had this paralyzed, maybe on this Milo tick, we could be running things now. But Water Spout's gonna pop out here. Do some mean damage to the kiss. Doesn't take him out. Aqua Jet can fly through, take it out. And then we can drop a big rock on that thing, to be honest. We can drop a big, big rock on it. Let's go Dynamax. And go into this over on the Milotic. I want to really do some damage to that Milotic. Just have Aqua Jet fly out and take out the Togekiss. Let's get it, baby. What you want? What you want? Match isn't over yet. We're not calling quits yet. We got our Steam Engine all that triggered. We'll be able to fly out here. But the worst part actually is that we what's it called? That we don't we didn't get that paralyzed on that Milotic. This is the worst part. I totally wish it would have been huge. I think I think this match could have been possibly over. Let's see what happens. Protect Milotic. Follow me, Tokus. That's kind of like I kind of figured that happened. And that's why I'm going into Aqua Jet for the KO. Now you're protecting your Milotic. He does not. Aqua Jet. Yeah, yeah. Get him out of here. Get him going. Go on. Tokus is gone. I'm thinking this uh this rock should be able to take out. Like hands down. Let's see it happen. 
G-Max vocalist. Get him out of here. Get him going. Boom. Take him out. Let's go. Let's go. Sitting pretty now. We have all this on the field. We have the rain for a Blastoise with that rain -ish. We have the plus six speed. The weakness policy trigger. And I think it's just a 2v1, right? Right? 2v1? We take out Milotic, Togekiss. I don't even know. Milotic, Togekiss. We knocked off items on... Oh, the Whimscot. Yeah, it's 2v1. 2v1, baby. Looking good for us. G-Max Colossal coming in clutch in the end. That's what's so good about him. He's a rocket fire type. But he kind of... Like, water does damage to him. But, like at a price to pay it's like okay I, i'm gonna hit this thing but i have to make sure i kill him because if not he's gonna be coming back stronger than ever and he's g-max now yo i love this g-max move i like how the uh the volcano rocks just come flying down but yeah 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 who you sending out hopefully it's like a wormple <laughs> a badoof <laughs> you haven't seen those boys in forever why don't they add badoof in the dlc like everyone be like yeah badoof but doof, baby. He goes to the lags. Okay, yeah, we got this one pretty much wrapped up. I'm full health Blastoids. Water Spout's going to be able to do some big damage. Um, I'm just going to... Actually, this is, we have Stab Rock. We're just going to go into this. Drop a little bit of Water Spout. This is going to be some big damage. Probably pick up the KO and call it a game. Or he's just going to cancel it. So, let's get it. Let's get it, baby. Hopefully, I don't jinx myself right here and he doesn't do some crazy stuff. And just ends up winning it like, oh, it's a Ditto. Transforms into Ho-Oh. Bye, bye, bye. I'm just... <laughs> <laughs> that would be hilarious. Yo, G-Max Colossal coming up clutch this match. Coming up clutch. Yeah, I always like to get that Vocalith out so it just does pester damage throughout the rest of the match. Especially when I had to kill off Pokemon. So now we have three different sources of damage here. For my Blastoids, the Vocalith damage, and this um, Colossal. Let's see, that should be game. We both should be able to outspeed. Let's just say GG. Look at that big damage here. A Water Spout stab in the rain. He eats his berry. I don't even know what he's going for, to be honest. I still think this takes him out should be big special attack damage here water spout full health in the rain stab built come on let's go let's go gg one in one with this team i really like how i played that one i really do i knew he was gonna go into the like the milo tick or something i definitely want to take off the item but i wish i would have got that nuzzle off but we in the end we still pick up that win third and final battle going up against a g max lapis guys if you are hanging out with me give me a little bit of hashtag hmm Hmm, blast call. Hashtag blast call in the comment section down below. Let's me know who's hanging out and who watched the videos all the way through. But we are going up against G-Max Lapras. Gotta kinda play it safe. We are one and one here. Should be two and oh. Stupid Miss Aqua Jet. Still salty once again, even after both of those battles, or just the one battle. But he has the toad kiss, he has the cocktail, potential fake out, he has the Venusaur, Cooler Felt, decorate up creme, I guess. Intimidate. We already know probably what that incident was running. Uh bum 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 bum. Who should I go? Do I go put Simi to knock off items? Just right off the rip. I might go that. I might go here. Start some nuzzles. I might go same squad to be honest. To be honest, I might actually set same squad. But I could just roll a hefty trigger here. Could. I could. Actually, we have to pick right now. Actually, back. Let's back you off. I'm going to roll a trigger here. I'm going to go no Pissimian and I'm going to go all the way up here. Yes, sir. Let's get it. Let's go, baby. What you want? We're going to roll a hefty trick room, try to take the trick room route with this side. He has a rather speedy team, I guess. A little bit, a little bit, half and half. Maybe I should have just went Colossal into, uh, what's called turn one? That could have been type nice. Colossal into the boy, Blastoids, and have, uh, because if he goes G-Max Lapras, I could have protected him, have it just trigger the stuff like we did last match. Right, let's go. Lapras, Alpha Crew, man. Ooh. Hmm. Cloth Wait. Wait, what just happened? Why do I have these two guys out here? What is going on? Wait, wait. Wait, what? Huh? Did I miss the timer? Did I, I guess I missed the timer. I didn't bring the Pelipper, but we're going to have to do some work here. We're going to have to do some work here. Struggle battle here. He's going to decorate the outcome. That's an obvious. I'm going to go Vocalith into you. And I'm going to go Hurricane. Or do I Tailwind? I don't think we need to Tailwind too, too much. Actually, oh no. Mm. I, I don't want to Scarf into something. I don't, I don't need to. I actually want to swap my Colossal. I actually genuinely want to swap my Colossal into my Blastoids. I'm just going to Hurricane up on that thing. Because I cannot, I cannot survive a Max Geyser from that thing. I just cannot. In the rain? And he's probably going to decorate as well? I just can't do it. I cannot take the risk here. Like, you know it's coming. You know it's coming. Like, I didn't even mean to leave the help. Now we're probably just going to get marked on. <laughs> okay. 
You guys are about to witness the greatest match ever. Jeans is about to do something crazy and end up winning this match. I don't know. It's, it's really not looking good for us right off the bat here. I had to take a swap. We know he's coming into my Blastoids. Well, my Colossal slot. Protect comes from the Alcare mate. I'm cool with it. And we're going to be able to maybe get a Confusion off on that. That would be huge. Tell me we get a Confusion off on that thing. Doom. Doom dirty. Nope. G-Max Resonance. Oh, is that all my Paloops? That's got me all my Paloops. Wow, we could have stayed in. Actually, did some work on them. We do eat, though. We do eat. Give me that. Give me that, baby. We eat that one up. And the rain. Or not the rain. The rain is still here. And the Roar Veil does get triggered. Uh, bruh. Bruh. I'm, just I'm doubling into this Alcreme. I'm sick of this Alcreme. What you want, Alcreme? You want the sauce, baby? We're going to outspeed you. I'm going to get you out of the way so you don't just decorate up on this thing. Ah, tough news, tough news, guys. Not not sitting well with me. We're not sitting well. Hurricane Pops. Doesn't do too, too much. I thought it would do a lot more than that. But we do get the confusion. We get a little ducky duckies. The flash cannon's going to pop through. Flash cannon. Yeah, yee, yeah, baby. Get him. Take him out. Big damage. Not enough, though. Not enough. We get a crit, baby. Ooh, -wee. A little bit of crit action. Ducks, hurt yourself. Come on. Do a little punchy punchy. Of course. He lands to decorate. Ego Lapras, have the game. That's how it is. That is how it is going to end for us. Stacking up lightning. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Rest easy, big turtle, dude. But of course, dude. I could have had this trick room set up and been rolling. This is not... Like, I didn't want this developer. This is not what I wanted. <laughs> it's all good. It's all good. Uh, Pacibian? Colossal? I think I think our best bet would be Dynamax the Dynamax the what's it called? The Pissimian. Drop a Max Knuckle into the El Creme. Take it out. Get that attack boost. Oh, does that take it out? I don't think it's gonna take it out. Ah! This is super effective with that. I could get the uh, defense boost. Doesn't really. Do this could drop. It's a special defense. Ah! What do I do? Oh, dude, I. Mm. I really want to boost her stats. I got a punch on that thing. I got a punch on it. Hurricane's not missing. I got to roll out with a hurricane. Here. Oof. So this thing is going to be an absolute domination machine. This Lapras. If we make it out of this, I am a god sent from the heavens. Because <laughs> this thing's decorated. We're going to trigger its ruthless policy. So this thing's like plus 9,553 on special attack board. It has almost 500 HP. Like, what do you want me to do? Why is this in the game? <laughs> but don't worry. We got Coconut Monkey over here with the coconut hat. Like, what you want? <laughs> Can't beat Coconut Monkey. Coconut Monkey don't care. So Hurricane will pick up the KO here. Bye-bye, cream, cream, creme boulet. Then the knuckle's gonna fly through. Ooh. Look at that policy policy. Maybe we should have knocked off before we D Max. But I feel like he was just gonna tank on us anyway. Dude, that thing's just too tanky as well. That thing's an absolute monster. Can you take out my pol my polyps, please? Oh, he's not weak this policy. That's that's good news though. Are we gonna eat this one? We are assault vested too. We survive on one. We gotta crit. What is this game today? My luck is just doo-doo. <laughs> Like, my luck's just doo-doo right now. It's a crit, but we do survive on one, so that means we get another turn. And Gothitelle is just going to fake out here, so... I could guard. I am going to guard. It's a fact. Guards are popping. We do not have a guard, of course. The knuckles are popping. But I gotta go Hurricane over on this Gothitelle. Like, we have the Cole boy in the back end, but I don't think Cole's surviving any shots. He's got to just drop fake out to get that first turn and take out my my monkey Coco, my Coco monkey, my coconut monko. Let's see. Hurricane. Oh, he does not. So you're saying there's a chance, baby. So you're saying there's a chance. Pelper gets that. And this Max Knuckle could KO. So you're saying there's a chance, baby. Okay. All right. All right. Say less. Rain should be ending soon as well. We've been chilling here for a while. We get that attack boost. Who's he going at? No, he's definitely going for Dazzling Gleam. Or a double move, so hopefully somebody dodges. Oh, he tr helping out my colossal potentially. Okay, so he trick rooms. 
But I think this thing just has Dazzling Beam and it's just gonna double up and take out my Pokemon here. Which is rather scary. And he goes Beam Beam. He goes Beam Beam. Okay. I'm gonna Darkness up on you. And then I'm gonna drop a little bit of Hurricane on you. Okay. So. I think we're both dead here, to be honest. The Venusaur is. Uh, actually, my Pissimian might be. Actually, I don't know. The Venusaur might be slower. Let's see what happens. He's got to be going for like a Dazzling Beam. Okay, Psychic pops out. Come on, Pissimian, go first. And at least take out a Pokemon for me. Because we could potentially win this match if he takes out a Mon for me. No! No! Venusaur goes in, gets the first turn, takes out my Pissimian. How could we roll out? We have Rock Slide, and we could potentially be the slowest on the field. Rain has stopped. No more rain going on. Uh, bum, bum, bum. Colossal, all comes down to you, big dog. What's the plan? What's the plan? Um, do, 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 do. Ro I guess Rock Slide's our best resort here. Rock Slizzle, or we can go into a Flare Blitz and just dump on the Venusaur. Yeah, that's the play. Because there's no way the Venusaur is slower than this Colossal. Let's go Flare Blitz here. I right, take out this Venusaur in one easy motion, just ya yeet, and then take out the, the what's called as well, and then focus on the the Poopa Nunu. We are slowest too. Take out KO KO. Oh, this thing's a tank. This thing's an absolute tank. And he's weakness policy. You got a weakness policy Venusaur. That's insane. Okay, um, I think that's game. <laughs> thief. Oh, you're going thief on me, yo. Get out of here. What you mean? Stole my weakness policy, and you're gonna put me to sleep. Hold the phone. Hold the phone. Hold the bananas. There's no way this thing has protect. I should have run it. It has protect. <laughs> There's no way. Please show me it doesn't have protect. Or this thing might have ally switch. Oof. Leave me alone. He missed his sleep powder. Come on. He does not. Okay. Okay. Venusaur's gone. Hold the phone, baby. Hold your phone. Gone. Get him out of here. Get him gone. <laughs> what is this thing going for? Psychic? Fake tears. <laughs> okay. So our special defense is in the dumpster. So what's the play? Flare Blitz? Or Rock Slide? Let's go for Rock Slide. I'm gonna say we get flinch and then we just dump on it. That's the play call. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this match comes down to the wire. Genius drops a rock slide. He drops it. Does a decent amount. Can he get the flinch? He does not get the flinch. Oh no! Ah! <laughs> no! Okay, we lose that one. All good, all good. That was honestly a good match. Dang, dude, he had fake tears. I kind of want him it. But one and two, thinking it should have been two and one. Still salty though, first match. <laughs> this was actually my first time using a weakness policy colossal that I triggered myself. So I had tons of fun with it with that steam engine, the weakness policy, and it was a G Max colossal. So we got to show that off as well. But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everyone.